Hi everyone, so thank you for clicking onto my video of HuggyDownPaint.net. Before I teach you guys, I'll tell you guys that one of my videos have reached a thousand views. Yay! Over a thousand views actually. And I'm actually really, really proud of myself because at the beginning of my channel last year, uh, when I first created it, I didn't expect this. I expected like a hundred views and I'll be happy because I was getting like 10 views and 20 views. But, um, thank you so much for support, and let's start. So, I'm going to teach you guys how to paint down, paint, download, download paint.net. Paint.net is free, and it's actually a really nice software. So, let's go. Go to your internet browser. And X out YouTube. And go to paint.net. Okay, simple enough. My finger is close. Sorry. Paint.net, enter. And you visit this site. Now, you want to just click on this logo that says paint.net. Okay, or you just click on that link, it's the same thing. And you'll go on this page called Donate. And you see that these two links are purple because I clicked on them before. Just ignore that. You want to go to Downloads. Uh, as long as you have a, as long as you have um, 512 megabyte RAM and you're running on either Windows 7, XP, or Vista, then you should be okay. Um, Paint.net does use um, quite a lot of hard drive space because they have to, they're like, even if you don't save your project, they still have to remember the history. But like, you can't find it again if you don't save it. It's 3.5 megabytes itself. It's the newest version, October 9th, 2011. Um, depends on when you're watching this, but if there's a new version of something, I'll probably make a new video. Um, so it says, if you want to download it, please use one of the download buttons. And it took me a while to tell my friends because um, they wanted me to make a tutorial to notice, but click this button. It's quite obvious. Now you come to this page, you can read it if you want, but just click on free download now. Just click on that. Right there. And uh, you want to click that. I have WinRAR, so this page comes up. Um, and you would just want to double click this app install thing. But if you don't have WinRAR, this would just pop up. Just say yes. It says it's installing the setup. Um, it's fairly fast. But I'll probably like, um, speed up the download later. Okay, um, here it is. Now it says the installer will help you install paint.net. Choose the install least your method you prefer. I would rather choose quick and you do not want custom. Choose your language. I'm um, supposing that you're using English. So go to next. You can read out copyrights. Usually people don't. Just click I agree. Say next. And it will start downloading. Done is free of charge if you pay money for it other than donate, then we recommend that you get refunds. So, you know, people are trying to um, scam your shit. Just paint on it, it's not really the best. Now, they're removing my old version because I got old version, um, and paint on it's actually quite smart to do that. Because I was planning to do it manually, but they did it for me anyway. So it's quite easy to do this. I'm just going to speed up this progress. It's almost done. Okay. So it says it's installed successfully, just click on finish. And you want to minimize your window. And you have it, you have paint.net. Um, so this is how it looks, you have your colors, 
if you accidentally exit a uh, panel or something, uh, you're supposed to go to. Oh shit, forgot. Windows, yeah, Windows, and then, yeah, there they are. So if you don't, you accidentally exit out colors, you don't know how to get your color, go to Windows and go to colors. Because that was a really, really bad time trying to figure it out. So anyway, hope you help. Oh, uh, please comment. I'm just going to comment, I know, but I'm trying to reduce space. And then you could like. And if you want, you could sub. Okay, thanks, bye.